This demo shows how to uh, implement this translation element uh, into your website in an ASP uh, X website for Microsoft. So uh, <coughs> as you see, this is a little tool from uh, from Google, and they implemented the uh, this small stuff and uh, website translation on the fly. Uh, so how does this work? I also uh, already made a small link on this and a small uh, blog. So what we have to do, we have to open the uh, Google Translate or translate.google.com website. There you have to enter your, uh, your website and uh, you have to say which uh, uh, language your website wh what the source is the original uh, language and to which languages do you want to uh, translate this website and okay something like this uh, okay Russian what doesn't matter okay and and then you have to uh, type the uh, you have to select the uh, the layout and you have to, uh, three possible uh, uh, selections. I think uh, the inline selection, this one, this is the smallest one, and this uh, works quite quite good. And then you have to, uh, then you will get the code. And this code, you have to copy that code. And now what we do here is uh, we go to our website, and in the website you say. Uh, there you have to look where it's uh, placed all you have to do is you have to drop your code in there uh, this it's a diff container so when you're in a saml file in sitemaster or in a or in a default an aspx site then all you have to do there is you have to uh, implement it, drop it in there, and then run your site. website is opening and that's it now the element is implemented there and you may translate your website uh, on the fly so I hope I could help you with this one and if you liked it uh, subscribe the channel